So it's not sympathy for the devil or anything like that. I just started to think about, I should make sure to post this, try to post these in order so that I'm, I'm good and consistent and that how I reacted to things were relatively in order on YouTube. Because I kind of look at it as something that records history a little. Maybe, maybe there's a bunch of glowies and spookies that are uh, archiving all of this. Who knows? Maybe I'm that important to somebody. Anyway, something I was thinking about was a critical, critical issue about destiny. Really, actually, I should just say. Stephen Bunnell, the second or third, that really what it is, is that the, it's, there's no fun in making fun of him. You know, it's, it, it, that's what people do to him all the time. Like, he, I mean, he's rich. He's, that, that whole idea of pursue you're rich, you got rich off the internet, have fun. At some point you're going to be 40, bro. Drink from the kegs of your life when you're old. And do things while you're young. You only got one chance to be a fighter. You only have one chance to find out if you get knocked out easy. <laughs> uh, it's the way it is. So live. You know, you're young. Um, because I don't think you're happy at all with what you're doing. I just, I just can't see how what you're doing is now bringing you happiness in any way, shape, or form. Um, And also, you're on some kind of drugs that's cooking your fucking brain. And I, I just, this, this really comes from something I can't really disclose who in my life I'm talking about. There's been a number of people, but, but somebody in particular. A certain government bureau would prescribe this person all kinds of stuff to help them feel okay in their skin. And they would tell me in confidence about just how utterly miserable the roller coaster was going up and down and sideways sometimes. Having to call somebody, book an appointment, talk to somebody... When really what they started to find was that if they just had somebody to talk to about some things, that it was a lot better for them. Um, it saved them a lot, and it saved a lot of the physical, a lot of the physical issues that come with psychiatric drugs. So, I don't like the way your jaws move in Destiny. It, it freaks me out. It sets off a lot of my alarm bells. It it's not a it's not a normal movement. I don't know if it's like a thing you do, like some weird tick, or it's something like you're like you're chewing gum or something. Or I, I don't know. I don't watch you enough. But when you're talking, your jaw moves in a certain way that shows particular ways the nervous system is, is being stimulated um, and it's just it's just not good and and it's also this idea too of once you are familiar with even attempting violence and you get some measure of how good you are against other people you it's wonderfully humbling. <laughs> Also, once you actually ever engage in anything that actually kind of helps somebody with pain or an injury, it's incredibly, it just connects you to humanity in a way you never imagined. That just a little, this, some weird tradition of wisdom 
preserve this gem and you were able to help somebody that would like solve a real physical issue with themselves it's real a real problem and they just had no method of solving it and it's that kind of feeling you have to go with that i mean that that's all life's really about man um and so at some stage it's whatever is deeply your joy you're gonna have to embrace it because one of the things about politics is knowledge isn't going to help this is very important knowing more won't help and especially if you're on the left and you've entrenched yourself there in some way it's not going to get better it's not going to feel better knowing more doesn't help in that way it's just the way the human spirit is i don't get it it's just how it is that's what all these wise people admonish in all these ancient tomes Woo! oh that's a beauty that that was a beautiful fucking bike um but the uh, it, it just yeah you're you're not going to feel happiness from being politically like awesome people thinking like wow man do you know all you know all this stuff that's it's not going to help make things feel better and also it's because for some reason you like being kind of weirdly contrarian to what is obviously correct and i don't really get that one either um yeah and, and why you keep playing into that and then get beaten up and made fun of. I don't really get that, that shtick or that way of thinking. I kind of do. Kind of. But, uh, yeah, I kind of do. So, okay. Well, have a, well, best of luck. Take care.